Hello everybody! We're here doing some voice over redos with Joey Ranieri. Uh -uh. No Blaze more. Lieutenant Dan! No I don't. Yes he does. He's going to be in this tomb of death. Right now he's in the tomb of death. But he's gonna be in this tomb of death and he's going to do his voices. He's got oh. he's got he's got two. <laughs> Plus additional lines. We're gonna have Tyler, who plays Toothpick here tonight, a little bit later on, too. And yeah, we are getting stuff done that wasn't done before, as well as mistakes that happened because there were a few of them. And we're starting right now. Meow. 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 Uh, uh. Okay, get in your cage. Uh, this is. This is your future. <laughs> this is my future. <laughs> Next spring and summer. <laughs> oh man. Uh. Okay, really, we gotta get started. Bye. Okay, we're back again. Here's Tyler. So, uh, Tyler, say hi. Hey, man. What's up? Hey. Yeah, yeah. I feel like I, I'm getting more and more of these. Well. I, I, I took, I took, I took uh, Joey back home, and now we're um, oh, it's Joey. doing uh, Tyler Joey. stuff. Lieutenant Dan, Joey, oh. and your toothpick, Tyler. I Here, you go ahead, take it. You don't got no legs, Lieutenant Dan. And okay, we're just gonna do the first line. Here's blankets. Cause I gotta. Where are we at? Okay. I so, got him. You can you can say this a couple times, and it's like an excited toothpick, you know. Oh. I got him. I got him. I got him, Lieutenant Dan. Less, less. Uh, less. Can I hear one from last less, time? Less, less bass. Uh. Yeah, you can you can hear. Uh, thank you. Oh, I just hear one from last time. I'll know what I did. All right. Well, Look at the hippie. Observe the hippie in his natural habitat. No, Tim. I'm not a hippie. On the hipster computer. That is not why. I grew On the my hipster hair. computer. That is not why I grew my. Hair. Notice. Okay. The sleeveless shirt. The boot cut jeans. Oh. I ran out of oh, that. Yeah. Cool. Oh man, that's embarrassing to hear yourself. <laughs> <laughs> it's not yourself. It's your character. That's still embarrassing. I ran out of grenade. I ran out of grenade. Oh, wait, here's here's another one. Here's it's another like flamboyant. Gosh. It's like this. Toothpick, if you can hear me, it's time for you to use your grenades. Grenades? Yay! Yay. My, my grenades now. It's like Spongebob mixed with like a flamboyant Forrest Gump. Did you see you're, you're still up here? Your character's still up here? And... Do you see that? The Maros start uh, cloning themselves to get more... to build their numbers up to where you've destroyed them. Um, and then he sees it, and then he's like, "Uh oh!" And he leaves. So you can go like, you go like, "Whoops!" or "Uh oh!" or something like that as as you're leaving. Okay. Oh no. Yeah. Or oh no. That's oh it. no. Okay. Day after. This guy. He can't do one friggin' line. One line. One line. One. One. Friggin' line. Can't do it. Just one. Just try. I can't. Hey, Bubba Dan. Look, there's a road sergeant talking about. Let's do this thing, man. Let's go. That's not the line. All you need is like a shower head on top of you, you know. You like. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking of way too many non-rated G jokes right now. Yeah. For all y'all that actually want to know what my line actually is. Lieutenant Dan, look, a road. It must be the one Sarge was talking about. And it sucks. <laughs> so, Dean's here. He's doing one line. One. And then an additional line that I thought of today. And then other little lines that I might use for, like, the whole three seasons whenever I feel like putting it in there. One line. One line. He can't, he can't, 
<laughs> you can't do it. No. No, I we might have to rewrite the thing, maybe, I'm thinking. So that might be a better idea. I actually just came in yeah, he, he's nodding. Yeah, oh yeah, okay. So yeah, we'll probably I'll probably rehash this, think this through, spend another two hours, you know, trying <laughs> He's looking at me like, what? No, he doesn't have that time. Where's no. the robe? I'm going to hang myself. <laughs> yeah. Just a second. <laughs> anyway. Anyway. That's Dean. He is Gimp. And... I'll see you next time when we have another voice actor in here later. Okay, we're back. Dean's gone. And we're going to do, we're going to work with the next voice actor. And the next voice actor is me. Hi. I think you've seen me before. But yes, I'm going to do some lines of some weird creatures. They're going to be going like, something like that. So. I'm going to do that a few times because there's a few monster warrior type guys through it. And, uh, yeah. It's just me alone here because if anybody really saw me doing this live, uh, I don't think they'd want to be around me much anymore. Which is probably why Joey is scared of me now. Anyway, so I'm going to do this and see you next time I have another voice actor over. Okay, now Corey's about to come over here. My fourth airborne elite that I need your voice is worse for, but before he comes, I just wanted to show you guys this little setup here. This is how I'm doing my studio stuff from now on. One way or another, whether it be here in someone's house, I have to angle it in a way to where everything's covered, and that way you get really good quality sound when you do it this way, and it just sounds so much better. So in future season of Tales of Valhalla, I'm going to have the audio so much better than what it is. I mean, it's okay for this season, but... Uh, just doing it this way just makes it there's there's no bounce um, as far as the sound goes barely any uh, just makes the audio quality for the voiceover so much better so just wanted to show this to you and how I'm setting it up Hello everybody um, we just got finished doing the last of the voiceovers for Airborne Lead this is my friend Corey here Howdy. he just got his stuff done and he's gonna be heading out the door um, and I, so I decided to do this a little bit of vlog to end this week, and we'll see all of you next week. Later. Peace out.